Hello there, watchy people. How is it going? Welcome along to the Rags to Riches series on FS22. Uh, we are back. Um, I am currently um, on my way back from diving, actually. So, <clears throat> from my scuba diving trip. So, I have not been around the last week. So, if there has been any updates on FS25, um, past me recording this now hasn't heard about them. So you'll have to forgive me for not mentioning them. And also forgive me for droning on about FS25 for te the first 11 and a half minutes of the last episode. Um, I hope everyone here is actually interested in it. And therefore it was fine. But um, if not, I uh, I do apologise. It won't happen again. Not for that long anyway. Um, <clears throat> I wasn't sure whether I should have made like a whole separate video um, for that. Maybe I should have done. But I figured it's you guys that... That are going to be interested in it anyway so yeah i don't know um i was just looking to see <clears throat> whether we have uh new mowers and we do not we've still got this mower so where is my weight there is a weight of ah there it is it's right in front of me over here um in a really stupid orientation uh, what I might do is do I have yes I have super strength I am gonna just twizzle this around oh blimey I didn't mean to do that there we go so it's the right way around and then we can uh, raise this off the floor I think can we oh there we are in fact we have to fold it up <laughs> Uh, yes I need to get it through the gateway lovely right now we can unfold it again and cut this bit of grass so yes um, I still don't have uh, the ability to tell you how my diving trip went because I'm not back from it yet uh, I will be doing a vlog but uh, don't expect that to be out for at least a week, maybe two. I don't know, it depends. If I get time to edit it, then I will. Um, but uh, otherwise, it's just going to be as and when. Because I've got a lot of other things on as well. I've got a two-week gap now in which to edit the big video that I shot, the school promo that I shot uh, a few weeks back. That needs to be done by the end uh, of August. So that's a little bit of pressure on that one, but um, I'm sure we'll get it done. Uh, if all goes well, it should be fine. Uh, oof. Bit of a hard bump into the bush there. <clears throat> I was going to get the AI to do this, but the, what, the bits I've got are so small and annoying that I'm not sure it'd cope. Um, interestingly, actually... Um, it'll be it'll be interesting to see how the new AI in FS25 cope with um, with self-made fields and like I've done here, larger fields that I've subdivided into smaller crops because obviously that's completely not an expected way to do things. Maybe it is. I don't know. Maybe the the devs have already thought of that and they've got it covered, but. I would say I'm, I'm acting slightly out of the parameters here. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'd have thought, I'd have thought most people, at some time, have a go at like splitting up a big field or combining two small fields, that sort of thing. So yeah, I don't know. I guess we will just have to wait and see how it goes. How are you guys? Are you guys doing well? Let me know in the comments. <clears throat> uh, I think um, a couple of weeks ago I was talking about how there's only like four or five people that watch this uh, all the way through and I don't know if I was a little um, I don't know if I sounded a little uh, salty about that because I'm definitely not salty about that at all if it came across that way, then I am uh, very sorry. Like I'm super 
super happy and grateful. Um, I mean, the, I do get I do get views like <clears throat> the people that don't stick around. There's a there's, you know at least thirty, sometimes there's like fifty or sixty of them. Uh, occasionally even more, but um, <clears throat> but yeah, it's just the diehards I was talking about, the ones that watch the video all the way through, and I'm how super appreciative I am of them. And uh, yeah, I'm very very grateful to have that many. Like that's that's I'm not like in the not in any way am I saying that that's insignificant because it's not. Um, Tango's uh, I can't remember if he made it up or if. Uh, somebody he saw um, talking about it if, if he's taking it off of them but um, he said to me once well think about it as if your audience was in the room with you if they were there watching like would it feel small like if they were in your your recording room your lounge or whatever room you're recording like <clears throat> no actually my room would be pretty full and we'd be laughing and joking and having a great time so that's not you know I'm actually super stoked to have that many. It's, it's very cool. Um, and yeah, I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much for sticking with me through thick and thin. Because there's definitely been um, thin and I'm definitely thick quite a lot of the time. So um, I could understand people, uh, you know, giving up on me, but you haven't. So but thank you very much for that. I am super, super happy to have you guys. <clears throat> right, we're about uh, what a quarter of the way through this field. This is going to be an interesting one to win row. Um, so yeah, I am thinking that I might get the upgrade with the uh, the mower that also rows. I think that would be a good way to go. Uh, I keep mentioning things that I'm going to buy. Um, at some point, I have to be honest with myself. I can only buy one thing at a time. So I need to figure out what uh, what the priorities are with that. Whether I want the harvester first or whatever. But I've got a feeling that we're going to be okay. I think you know money's going to be coming in fairly um, consistently now. <clears throat> so it should all be good. Like I mean, oh wait a minute, what's happened over there? Oh. Oh, okay, those are silage, silage bales that I've kept for some reason. Alright, that's interesting. I don't know why... Oh, I'm keeping them till the price is good. That's what it is. Cool, and there's my hay bales there. I looked over and I panicked because the hay, the hay bales had gone brown, you know? They'd gone off. I didn't think they did that in this game ever. But no, it's fine. They're just stacked in a different place and those are... Stored silage bales waiting for uh, waiting for good money because we've got no urgent need for cash right now. We've got uh, nearly eighty grand in the bank. So yeah, why we, why do we need to uh, <clears throat> why do we need to sell stuff for less money than we could get for it later on? The answer is we don't. So uh, let's just get this last bit of grass mopped up. Um, yeah, we're we're doing super good for um, for grass for hay. Maybe I should be buying the next uh, sheep farm, the next sheep enclosure. I think that might be what I ought to do next. Realistically, it would make uh, a lot of sense to do that. There we go. Right you up turn you off as that will do for the grass and then we'll put it back where we found it this thing could probably do with being uh, oh I think we did uh, repair it last time actually just a shame that you can't put that down um, fold it up uh, let's put you down as well and then we can go and get our Windrower. Figure out what on earth we're going to do. Uh, I think we'll just do a straight line down there, actually. Let's go 
straight down here. And then we'll loop, uh, loop back and get those bits as well. Lovely. Get all of that in if we can. Super. Uh, then we're going to have to go along here. Because there's no way we're going to get uh, anything else, any other way of doing that one. Cool. That's good. And then we can just shoot down here. I'm just going in really bizarre... Bizarre routes right now. <laughs> I don't know what else to do, really. <clears throat> just trying to keep it in a straight line without turning too much. Like, There we go. We've got this side covered now. And hopefully, there we go. We managed to not catch the uh, thing of wool there. So now we'll go along here. Hopefully get all of this chunk. Oof, not quite. Not quite. Alright, well we've left it in straight lines anyway, so that's something. Uh, and then we'll go round here. And down this way. There we are. Lovely. And I should have uh, gone along that edge first, shouldn't I? Uh, let's go do that now. <laughs> yeah, I don't know quite how this is going to work entirely. We'll just do the best we can. I guess I'm going to turn down here and catch as much of that as I am able to all around the edge here. Nice. And then come back up this way. Hopefully I'll get everything there. <laughs> Man, I've never been able to do like a super neat job of uh, of this. It's always eluded me. But it's fine. We don't need it to be super, super neat. There we are. Let's just try and get down here. And then we'll go around this way. Get all of these bits. And a little bit more by the looks of it. And there we go. And then scoop the last bits of that into that one. Man, that was not tidy, but I think I'll take it for now. There we go. Another line down there. go down here. Sweet. This is not the uh, the best job. It might be the best job I've done. I'm not sure. And a little Arthur kitten has just come into the room to say hello. Hello pussy cat. Um, see if we can... Oh, I've got a thingy of uh, lettuce there. And another one to do as well. Another few crates. Oh, I didn't mean to fold that up. Hello, Arthur. Good boy. He's come to keep me... Well, I don't know if he's come to keep me company. Are you gonna, have I got put a bag on his chair? There you go. I've moved the bag. Sit down. There you go, boy. No, he's not interested going to now investigate the bag that I've put on the uh, on the floor instead. Far more interesting. <laughs> there you go. Now he's jumped up on the chair. Good boy. Uh, right. Concentrate on making a video, not on uh, silly cat antics. I don't know how you can not concentrate on silly cat antics, though. 
They demand your full attention and often deserve it. Oh, hello. He's up on the desk now. Yeah, that's that's going to make my job easier. Thanks for that, cat. Appreciate it. <laughs> there we go. Right. Oh. Oh dear. He's just knocked a whole box of chocolate brownies onto the floor. I really ought to pause the video while I'm dealing with him, but... Oh, Arthur. He is a right pain in the butt. Sorry about that, guys. Right, uh, I think, if I'm not mistaken, we're basically done with that. We do have the other field to do, though. So we'll head over and do that as well. Uh, it shouldn't take us too long. Let's fold it up to get it through the gate. This one, uh, yeah, I think will be a fairly super quick um, job. So let's just do the perimeter first. I do see a lot of people, they do the straight lines first and then tidy up the perimeter, which might be a better way of doing it go as far as you can actually get with the straight lines and then oh blimey look at this traffic look at this traffic I hope that this will be a thing of the past in 25 as well they on their bonus slide in uh, information they gave out uh, like a week and a half ago now um, they did say that there's going to be uh, traffic and um, traffic navigational updates in the new thing so that is very cool to hear much much needed all right let's do one more of those to give ourselves plenty of space and then i think we should be good to do the lines <clears throat> Well, let's hope I don't need to leave um, today, leave the farm today, because the traffic out there is a nightmare. There we go. I hate that there, I've always got like a little bit of a bump on the end of the line there. It's never a straight, straight one, but uh, what can you do? Uh, I might even be able to yeah there we go we we nearly got every little bit of it not quite but close do it as a bit of a spiral and then uh, yeah one more line and we should be done I reckon I uh, I won't do the bailing live I will spare you that uh, boredom and um, oh, there we go and do that in a hyperlapse <clears throat> it will be uh, much better that way I'll probably do the collecting and wrapping of the bales in a hyperlapse as well uh, there we go. Right. Job done with that. Go and put this away. As best I can. It's the uh, rear wheel steering on these. It doesn't help you out at all. Okay, cool. That's that bit done. The baler is in that shed over there. <clears throat> so I will get that and I will see you after the hyperlapse.
go, that's the last one. And then we push that one out <clears throat> to get it wrapped. Lovely. And that is this machine then finished with for the next couple of months. Oh, come on, start the engine. It's that one, start the engine. There we go. Hold it up, stop the engine, and hop out. Cool. <clears throat> right, yeah, another another two or three months for this to regrow again. And then we'll repeat the whole process. Okay, cool. Uh, now I remember seeing over here, we had some more lettuce spawn. So we'll drop this over here. It's much more boring having just lettuce instead of having like strawberries as well. <clears throat> Added a bit of colour to the thing, didn't it? Um, but it's for the best. At least I think it is. Come on. That way. There we go. On there. Lovely. Cool. Sort of stacked. Let's go see how we're doing over here. Uh, we can get another pallet of eggs, I think. And drop these. Oof. Pick that up a bit further in front of us so that we can run. Uh, drop those in there. <clears throat> and then it'll take them as it needs them. How are you doing for canola oil? Three and a half thousand litres. I don't think we've got any more yet, have we? Oh, just notice we're on one time as well. Should be on three. To get the morning going nicely. Cool, cool. Uh, I think that's everything in terms of... Um, things to worry about. Let's check the animals. We know that the sheep are fine because we can see that they've still got um, still got bales of hay in their feed troughs or in front of their feed troughs. Um, we're down to 11,000 litres but that's cool because we're, we're good for that. Do we have anything more in here? No, silo's empty so yeah we'll need to uh, we'll need to deal with that. <clears throat> Um, how is this doing as well? This is made... Oh, it's got 58,000 litres in it, so that's fine. It accepted all of our fields, so we didn't need to put anything in the silo from the canola. That's good. Uh, it's now just a case of how quickly we can make mayo. We haven't had a single pallet yet. Um, we've got 659 litres, um, which is exciting. That'll all be good. Let's go over and have a look at our other fields. They should be green now with, yep, with the uh, oil seed in them. <clears throat> so these are technically ready to plant, but I think we're going to do a different, um, a different crop this year. Um, oh, actually, maybe we shouldn't. We did talk about doing sunflowers as well. That could be a thing. We just need to um, decide on our priorities. I think I need to get the new harvester first. So maybe we will do another another year of canola. So I think this field is going to be the barley. And that will be for the chicken feed. And then everything else, maybe that one should be. I don't know. Which one looks bigger on the map? Uh, to be honest, they're pretty comparable in size, so it doesn't really matter which one's which. Okay. Well, let's um, let's go back. <clears throat> Man, it's so funny seeing buildings there now. We used to look look across the street, and it was just uh, just fields. Now we got buildings. It's it's crazy. Right. Okay. Um. So we can. Uh, <clears throat> empty out. In fact, I think I think I made a boo-boo um, with putting the um, fertilizer in here. I think I wasn't going to do that anymore and it was all going to go in the sprayer and we were just going to spray because we got so much. Um... I think that was the idea. Uh, so we're going to have to empty this, pop out, and then 
We'll put this. In fact, let's put this. I so like that I can carry it without super strength. We'll put that there so that when we grab it next time, it can be filling up from that. And these will slide in. Wow, all of these I can pick up. That doesn't seem right. Maybe I've got something enabled that I shouldn't have. Uh, but who knows. Right, so let's fill you up. <clears throat> Wait a minute. It's still got... There we go. It still had some um, stuff in it. There we go. Both of you can go there. And you can go there. Wage payment? Who am I paying? What? I haven't got a worker on anywhere, have I? Oh, it's because I had it on one sp one time speed. It gives you uh, an hourly update on that. There we go. Let's get that going in again. <clears throat> yeah, it gives you an hourly update on that. Um, oh. oh, I think by changing the crop type, I stopped it from uh, from filling up. Let's get the uh, let's get all the seed in first. We don't have tons and tons of seed. So we are going to have to buy some more at some point in the near future. But let's see if we can get that... Oh, we can't get the barley field done because... Um, <clears throat> because you can't plant barley till next month. But we can do this field, so we will. We'll do this one. Uh, so we want it to be... Uh, canola. There we go. Right, turn you on. Drop you down. And uh, here we go with this. Now, yeah, like I say, I don't know if we um, fertilise the uh, oil seed or not because I'm so forgetful that I, don't, I won't know whether I... Uh, whether I did it uh, and I will have forgotten that I'd planned to not do it and do it with the, um, the spreader instead so realistically who knows what we're going to end up with in terms of uh, fertilizer on these fields anyway uh, let's do this in another hyperlapse and yeah I will see you shortly So there we go, that is uh, all the canola planted in this field. Two more fields to go. <clears throat> I'm kind of tempted to take out that hedge up there in the middle and make these two interlocking L-shaped fields. That might be quite cool, mightn't it? Uh, I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments. Um, yeah, so this is going to be... Um, <clears throat> uh, well, this is a video that I recorded last week, obviously. So if I if you made a comment in the last video, then I apologise if I need to address it and haven't. It's because I haven't seen it yet. Um, next week, uh, next week's video, I will have seen those comments and the comments from this video as well. So uh, I will be uh, I will be able to respond to everything then. So uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that there because we might need it to do the barley next time. That would make sense to be. The next thing to do, I think, is plant the barley, um, but we do have to sleep before that can happen, and we have to wait for this field to uh, to grow as well. 
Um, so anyway, thank you very much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed it, please leave a like and a comment. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>